In Brooklyn, five Hasidic men face gang beating charges in a vicious attack. The safety patrol members are accused of being part of a group that stopped and attacked a man walking through their neighborhood. CBS 2's Lou Young, live in Williamsburg with this one, Lou. The end of the five indictments uh, relate to that attack in Williamsburg. We're in Fort Greene waiting for the victim to come home to get a reaction from him. Uh, the 23-year-old man underwent uh, surgery to his eye to repair the damage from the assault. He was chased, held, kicked, and beaten. Take a look. This is how Taj Patterson looked after being beaten by a group of men on Flushing Avenue in Williamsburg, an attack with racial overtones because he's black and the alleged assailants are members of a Jewish community security patrol. Five men were indicted today for gang assault and other serious felonies. 39-year-old Abraham Winkler, 28-year-old Aaron Hollander, 25-year-old Joseph Freed, 21-year-old Mayor Herskovic, and 19-year-old Pincus Braver. The case moving forward today when two of the men returned from overseas where they apparently fled to avoid prosecution. Police Commissioner Bill Bratton says he's been monitoring the case since taking over the job in January. I was briefed on that incident every several days during the course of the investigation, and I'm glad to see that it has uh, come to a successful conclusion. At the time, the Shamron security people said that they were looking for uh, vandals who were uh, damaging cars, but there was no evidence of vandalism uh, the night of the attack, and... Um, None of the, uh, the were found. Uh, one call, no one called police, police say. No one called 911 until the attack was underway and passersby threatened to take photographs and then the men fled. We're live tonight in Fort Greene, Brooklyn. Lou Young, CBS 2 News. Thank you, Lou.